Okay, so the first card is uh, stranded, and you might feel as though you're stranded financially or emotionally with no help from anyone. You may feel cut off and out of touch, so time to take uh, make new plans and have the trust and faith in yourself. So you might feel be feeling very isolated, alone, and very unsupported at this particular moment. You've got the wisdom card over here, which says the doorways of your mind are open, and you have, will discover that you have talents that you didn't know that you possessed. So even though you're feeling very isolated, once you start relying on yourself, you're going to find that you have the talents and the abilities to be able to cope with the situation. <coughs> You've got the self-reliance card over here, so it says also don't rely on anybody else. Uh, know that this is only a temporary situation that you're going through, and your strength and your hard work will get you through whatever crisis you're going through. So it's time for you to rely on yourself and have confidence in yourself that you're going to be able to sort through this particular problem that you're going through. Um, in the past, you've got the outcome card over here, so you've been experiencing many obstacles, and there have been many lessons learned. Um, so your results and experience are presenting their rewards. So you have been going through a very difficult period, trying to overcome a lot of difficult situations, trying to get away from any problems and obstacles. So going into the future, you've got hidden forces for the next 11 months or so. There are hidden forces that are going to be working for you. And there might be, uh, this time might be uh, a time where you need to make some plans. There might be some travel uh, going on over here and, you know, there could be changes as far as your uh, marriage, career or investments go. So there's a big change coming in for you, uh, but you're going to have to learn about self-reliance right now. Rely on all your own abilities to get you through the situation. Nobody else is going to come and uh, get you out of it. You're going to be able to sort it out, but sort it out by yourself. And this is going to be the thing that opens doorways for you. Okay, so those are the energies for that week. So this is the general read. Okay, you've got the Prince of Wands over here. So this is about travel. So you might be thinking about traveling, uh, starting a job somewhere else. You might be dealing with a lot of foreign people as well with the Prince of Wands. So this is about, you know, um, changing jobs, moving to a new place, new new country, broadening your horizons, uh, and, uh, you know, maybe starting new projects um, that involves dealing with a lot of foreign people. So that could be the energy. This could also be that you're dealing with a fire sign person as well. So Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, uh, could be playing a very important role in your life right now, starting off new projects with them. So what's happening with you? You've got the Ten of Pentacles and the Six of Swords. It looks like you had a difficult work situation. You might be ending that as well, because this is about the Ten of Pentacles ending old, um, you know, work scenarios or something to do with money. And you've got the Six of uh, Swords here as moving away from a difficult situation. So you know you might be spending a lot of time retreating by yourself, but getting over a difficult sub circumstance and moving away from it, uh, traveling away. So it looks like there are two cars of travel. You might be ending an old job, and you might be traveling to start a new job somewhere else. And whatever that old job one was might have been a very difficult situation. Uh, you might have had a lot of problems in that, so you have cut ties, ended it. The Six of Swords is actually ending an old situation. Now, the, before the Six of Swords comes the Five of Swords, so whatever that situation was, there might have been a lot of um, nastiness going on over there. Maybe there's a lot of backstabbing, um, a lot of deception, lies, deceit going on over here. And, you know, you've had to move away from it. So maybe this is why you've cut or you've ended this particular scenario. So you might have finished an old job and moving to something brand new there. You've got the Seven of uh, Cups over here. So you were... Uh, you know, going through a lot of confusion in the past year, a lot of options, a lot of choices, maybe all these. This is usually about toxic deception. So, you know, there's been lots of chaos and confusion going on, maybe promises made that were never fulfilled. Uh, people were not uh, being very upfront and honest about things as well with the Seven of Cups. So, you know, you've been, uh, you know, not really very stable in this last year. 
and you've got the three of swords over here so there looks like there's some kind of heartbreak situation that you've been going through now this is all about a relationship and about a love scenario it looks like there was a breakup over here uh you know lack of communication there might have been a third party situation you've got the ten of pentacles over here this is the ending of a family situation so this could well be a divorce that happened and you're now moving away from that uh, difficult situation so it could have been a family situation uh, you've severed ties with that relationship and you're moving away and moving away by yourself after having gone through a very very hot difficult heartbreak situation as well you've got the ace of pentacles it looks like you want to start something brand new if this is an old job and a job that you're ending then you're going to you want to start something brand new as far as a work uh, scenario goes if this is a family or a, a emotional situation it seems like you do want a new relationship to come in but definitely you want something that is much more financially based and you are um you know you want more money to come in you you need money to come in with this ace of pentacles and this is the thing that you are focusing as well so you've got the three of cups over here it looks like the you know whatever that difficult situation is you're going to need to get some advice from friends uh, or you're going to have to rely on friends for that kind of support to get you through this difficult situation so something there that you know this is about celebrating um you know uh, almost um it's exchanging emotional um ideas with people so there are people around you that you're going to actually have to ask for some kind of support from uh, to get you through this difficult situation because you are going through something where you're feeling very very lonely and it is time for you to actually uh, look for that emotional support from people around you so what's happening with you You've got the three of pentacles where you're very very focused on your work so if this was a difficult situation over here that you were dealing on a family basis uh, it seems like you are uh, you know asking for that um, uh, support emotional support from people around you but you are now going back to focusing on your work and if you have left another a, a job and this was uh, um, where you have actually lost a job and you've actually needed to move away from that difficult uh, position because you were having so much of problems in it it looks like there's a new job coming in for you where you will get money coming in as well and financial stability coming in but you will be working pretty hard um you know but a lot of recognition coming in over here and working with a lot of people so you are going to be very very much focused on your work very soon you've got the queen of pentacles over here so this is the card of um in this deck it's about the goddess lakshmi and this is money and wealth coming into you so if you have been facing a very difficult financial problems and you've had to actually end that old job it looks like money is coming in for you and a new job coming in a new you know position of responsibility authority and new money coming in where you're going to be very financially independent you can see the money is flowing out from this woman's hand so there is money coming back into your hand again the ace of swords is you might be dealing with some kind of legal situation as well with the ace of swords but this is where you're hoping that you will be victorious in this particular scenario so whatever happened over here you want victory uh, as far as what is being said you want people to listen uh, to what you got to say so you do want to be able to speak your truth and if there were lies and deception going on over here, you want people to hear exactly what happened. So going to the future, you've got the King of Wands, the Hanged Man over here, and Temperance. So you might have an offer coming in for you, um, you know, on the work front of you, a new project coming in. Uh, you know, it might be a big business because the King of Wands is, you know, about, um, you know, status and uh, big companies um it's also about uh, people being very ruthless in that particular case so you whoever you're going to be working with you know you're going to have to produce the goods and work pretty hard um you know they they don't accept any kind of excuses you'll be working with somebody who's very um you know they don't they don't take any um any excuses for, for things not getting done on time so you know you're going to be working to deadlines and you're going to have to work pretty hard for it this might be also working um you know for somebody that's foreign um working with a broader international audience uh with the king of wands uh and maybe this could also be getting a promotion from wherever you have been at so maybe you left the old job to get a promotion into a position of authority uh in order for you to earn this extra money that is going to be coming for you now you've got the hangman over here it looks like there's something that's going to have to be sacrificed over here this is might be an uh, a sacrifice of time of effort maybe you're going to be working longer hours but you're going to have to give something to get something so maybe you're going to have to move home because the king of wands is also about travel traveling somewhere else so maybe give up your current home to go and get a job somewhere else or also might be that you'll have to work extra hours um, but there's something of your time or your effort or your energy that will have to be sacrificed in order for you to uh, be able to overcome the situation as well 
and you've got the temperance card over here so you're going to have to use all your talents and skills that you have accumulated uh, in the past in order for you to make this particular project work so you're going to have to draw on some skills get some advice if you're going through any kind of difficulties on an emotional front this is about emotional healing as well so um, you know whatever you're um, you're doing you're going to have to blend things together you might have to be dealing with people maybe as a liaison be between people as well with this temperance card because this is mixing of of ideas mixing of people uh, mixing with people and uh, the temperance card is also ruled by Sagittarius so this could be something on it with a very international flavor on it and this could well mean traveling meeting other people taking their ideas and putting it into use in whatever projects you are doing as well so it looks like you will be making up for any kind of financial loss um, that you have been experiencing or that you have gone through and um, you know it looks like money is going to be coming in for you so whatever position you have is going to be or the job that you now get is going to be something that is better than the one that you left behind so don't regret leaving it it looks like it was a very difficult situation that you were dealing with uh, and but now you're now moving forward and you're going to be moving to something better you've got the seven of autumn over here which says the planning and resources and efforts you have invested in your dream will reap great rewards in the meantime have patience and meditate on your next steps so make sure you have a plan and be patient things are going to come your way then you've got the world card over here which says congratulations on successfully accomplishing what you set out to do you have made it through the challenges and incorporated the lessons life offered you with grace and courage so the world card is the ending of an old job situation generally because it's a card ruled by saturn and it looks like you've put an end to that situation and you are now moving forward there might be some kind of payoff um, that you get maybe some kind of bonus some kind of money coming in as well now that you've ended the situation, but you will now start something brand new after this. You've got the two of spring over here, which says your vision and creativity and dedication to your cause have brought you great success. In fact, it may be your best in your best interest to get a partner to assist you in your endeavors or expand the number of people helping you. So with this two of spring, it's like the two of rods. You might take on a, part, a partner or you might be working with somebody who will help you achieve your goals. Uh, you can see this particular pelican is helping the other pelican catch a fish so you can see that um you know you're going to have some help but also with the two of uh, wands or the two of spring it's about you know working on a very international basis communicating on a very uh, global basis as well so it looks like you are moving away from being confined uh locally into something that is now more global and uh, you know you are going to be meeting a lot more people with the three of cups is about socializing interacting networking with people in order to achieve your goals as well so it looks like whatever you've been through uh, whatever difficult situation you are going to be coming out of it and it looks like you're going to have to employ all your skills and talents that you learned maybe sacrifice a lot more time and effort into this and you'll be focused a lot on your work and achieving that money that will, will come in so I hope that this reading has resonated. Please don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Leave me some comments if it has. Thank you so much for watching. Take care now. Goodbye.